race. Start of jackpot one and racing away from the 1450 meter marker. So yeah, Varman got an alert start with one of the early leaders here with Tar Bomber and Whispers of War just behind it in the early stages. Laguna Verde settles in fourth ahead of Tizona and Tchaikovsky interprets those cheek pieces races at the back end some seven lengths off the leader as they race away past the 1200 and approach the thousand now so yeah, Varman in a good rhythm led by just over a length from Tsar Bomber, who races on his outside in second. Whispers of War in the blue and orange colours is third. To Zona, the green and white in fourth. Then came Laguna Verde, five lengths off the leader, with Turpitz improved to place, and Tchaikovsky as the back marker. Top of the elbow, 700 to go, and Suryo Varman led it by just over length, with Tsar Bomber in second. Whispers of War's third. Then came to Zona, followed by Laguna Verde. No change, with Turpitz towards the rear end, with Tchaikovsky. Off the false rail they come, and out in front is Suryo Varman, a length and a half clear of Tar Bomber in second. Whispers of War is away in third, and then came to Zona and Laguna Verde as they approach the last 300 metres. Suryo Varman's tackled up front by Tar Bomber. These two at the moment, with behind that Whispers of War. Here comes Laguna Verde on the outside, with Turpitz also making a good looking run, but it's Laguna Verde that has swept into the lead 200 out. Laguna Verde hits the front from Turpitz and Tchaikovsky. And Laguna Verde went on to win at a length. Second, Turpitz, Tchaikovsky, third, Whispers of War, then Tsar Bomber, Tazona, and nothing from Suryo Varman. Tazona, just ahead of uh, the other runners there, Tsar Bomber, I think, finished behind it. So he has a look at the closing stages. Well, Tar Bomber moved up to tackle the long-time leader, Suryo Varman, but the action was towards the stand side of the track where Laguna Verde was in full stride, and he comes through to score a good win from Turpitz in second. A third win for Laguna Verde. He mixed it up in his three-year-old career with the best of his generation. Suddenly went off a little bit of form, but nice to see him back, and maybe his confidence now will get a big injection after today's win. Three Laguna Verde, five Rand 50 win, two Rand 60 a place. I hasten to add the bipot gains more momentum. Well, it will be a popular winner indeed uh, for uh, number four, three, rather, Laguna Verde. Win number three from uh, 19 outings in the colours of uh, Mr. David Shaw. Did a Titanium Stud breathe this one? No, it is Clifton Stud. Welcome to the Blides out in Moy River. But uh, this win has been uh, on uh, the uh, cards for quite some time. It has, Cecil. You know, this, this horse, he, he's been a bit disappointing in the past. You know, he started off his career incredibly, and we thought he was going all the way to the top, and... He sort of just lost his heart and we kept trying and he just wasn't wasn't playing ball with us and I think what's what's been the best for him was Lucky putting him away. We gave him a good few months off and he's come back at different loss. He's put on a lot of condition and every run leading up to today has been positive. So um we are on with him again. Yeah, and for you, I I've lost count of the seconds and thirds you've had in the last few weeks. Eh? It's been one of those uh, periods. Yeah, it's probably been my worst month <laughs> in my career. The places are all there, but the wins have been uh, limited. But um, it's been a good week. It's starting to to click on nicely again, and we're going to go on from here. And of course, that, to get that winning trend as you go into the big weekend, it can only be a good feeling. Yeah, it definitely helps going into a day like the Met with... Um, good momentum, a few winners under you. I've got a nice card in PE tomorrow, so I'm hoping to pick up another two, three before Saturday. But yeah, it's, it's going to be an exciting weekend. Well, when you come back on the other side of the weekend, uh, we hope to be uh, praising and uh, congratulating you on that good last few days. Thanks so much, Cecil. Well done to Auntie Nats, CJ, they're doing duty while Lucky's on holiday in Cape Town, and David, um, they do this every second week. so. Oh, we, we sort of used to it by now, but well done to both of them. Well deserved. Well done to Benassi and all the guys back at home. Um, once again, I'm just glad for the opportunity and the, the staunch uh, support from Lucky and, and his team and to my sponsors, Moritz Fontenay Vogelbosch. Thank you.
Thank you so, so much. I want to to Mr. David Shaw, who is a steward of the Hudalaka stable. And I do say maybe the trick, we found out the trick, send the man away and you be on course and maybe <laughs> things will take a turn around. But I think you've just had a Actually, quite a spare time. Huh? You might have something there. <laughs> I didn't say that. The last time this horse won, I saddled him. Oh, so, <laughs> so, which was a long time ago. No, but but yeah. uh, for, first of all, great to see you. It's been Thank a long, long time. And you are you too, uh, one of my... Uh, yeah. Backbones in the industry, so to speak, Thank and uh, so, so good that it should be with a win. Oh, fantastic. I'm just, you know, I'm so chuffed for David. He's been so patient with this horse. Um, like Craig told you the whole story. Uh, and, you know, it's just finally the, his patience and his belief in the horse has paid off and the horse has given him another win. Um, so I'm just, I'm really pleased about that. Um, Nick and I have been actually shouting this on home every time. Eh? All of us. Yeah. <laughs> um, but, you know, like Craig said, he's, he, he's looking like a good horse. You know, he's, his condition's picked up. He's a happier horse. Um, so it's obviously now showing in his running as well. So just great, great job for, for everybody that put in the time and the effort with him. Just talking about Mr. David Shaw, he's got Viva Brazil, who got the better of one of the opponents in the race. I mean, no, the weights have favoured the yeah. opponents, but uh, what do you expect today? I think he's going to be, he's, he'll definitely be there. I think both our runners in that race are going to be in the in the shout. Oh, yeah, Terra Time. Yeah, we've got the old girl there as well. You know, she's also, when she puts her best foot forward, she can give a good gallop. But um, he's an up-and-coming youngster, so it'll be an interesting race. Yes, uh, regards to all, uh, one and all uh, in the family, and I'm not just talking about the young ones, but the older ones that we know from way back. Uh, yes, uh, you're talking about Dad, obviously. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> and Mum. They're both very well. Um, thank Please you for asking. I will do. And then just um, uh, also... Uh, well done, a shout out to Clifton Stud. I know Dave and Jenny have been waiting for this horse to win another one, and they keep asking what's wrong, what's wrong, so I'm um, well done to them as well. Thank you so much, Nat. It's, okay. It is hot, but uh, I think we're going to bring you back in the sun soon. <laughs> Hopefully. Thank you so much. Cheers. Thank you, thank you so much. And now you were saying, uh, Miss Modano, who is the winning groom? Come through. Who, Tavisa is the winning groom, and you are? This is Savito. So who's the winning group though? Vasco, that's right. I knew there was an O. <laughs> what, a, what a patronize me to say. Yeah, Tavito, well done. And please give our regards uh, to Vasco. Nice. And uh, we've been waiting for this win and it's come. Thank you very much. Sir. I would like to say thanks to the guys back at home. Thanks to my boss. He's on holiday. And well done to the team. Thank you so much. Well done to you. Huh? Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Well done to Vasco, the uh, groom of uh, Laguna Verde. And of course, uh, well done to Lucky Udalakis. Uh, nice to see Natalie Udalakis and the entire team behind the project. And of course, well done to Mr. David Shaw, the uh, winning uh, owner and the winning breeder. Peter and Jenny out in Moy River at uh, Clifton Stud.